Hi, welcome to my channel. This is Junior Miranda speaking. Here we can see a montage, a photo montage of Salyut 6 space station, the Soviet space station. Salyut 6 was launched in September 1977 in low Earth orbit. This bad photo montage shows two Soyuz spacecraft docked to Salyut 6, probably in the late 70s. Salyut 6 had a weight of almost 20 tons with a length of 13 and a half meters and a maximum diameter of little more than 4 meters. Here is a drawing of Salyut 6 with one Soyuz docked at front port and another Soyuz docked at the aft port. This space station was the first Soviet space station with two docking systems. So the main station crew, the main expedition, could be refueled in orbit by cargo spacecraft in addition to allowing the main expedition cosmonauts to receive visits from other crews during the course of their missions. Salyut consisted of three sealed cylindrical compartments, the front transition compartment, the working compartment with the two diameters, and the engine compartment, here the engine compartment, or OD ODU, the engine compartment, containing a rear intermediate chamber here inside the intermediate chamber with the uh, near the second docking system uh, the internal volume for the crew was about 90 cubic meters at the front the transition compartment had a side hatch here with a diameter of 60 centimeters for the exit of one of two cosmonauts in uh, extravehicular activity. The work compartment consisted of uh, two cylindrical zones of different diameters. Uh, the smaller one here, white, with the 2.9 meters, and the large brown section with the just over 4 meters diameter, connected by a 1.2 meter conical adapter and covered by EVTI thermal insulation. The total length of the work compartment was about 90 meters. Outside the small work compartment, there were three solar panels with a span of uh, about 16 and a half meter and an area of about 20 square meters with a total power capacity of four kilowatts. The solar panels could rotate to follow the sun. Looking at this photo, we can see several errors. I will approximate the photo. The first is obviously the lightning that's, that that uh, doesn't correspond to what is what was expected with the Earth placed in this position. But that is the least important aspect of this photographic montage. I will show you the original photo. Let me find the original photo. Here. Uh, this is the original photo 
with the shows only one Soyuz attached docked to the rear of Salyut. Here we notice the first error. See here that the Eagle approach and rendezvous antenna is placed on the right side. If you look at the space station from below, here, here there's an, the antenna. This antenna should be on the left. The original photo was flipped horizontally. Let me find here. Here is the original photo, the right photo. You can see the antenna here. As I said, the antenna should be on the left. The original photo was so flipped horizontally. Another Soyuz spacecraft was cut from another photo and uh, attached to Salyut's front transition compartment to give the impression that let me show the photo again to give the impression that there was another spacecraft docked at front. But we, if we take a closer look at the original photo, we will see another mistake. For a reason I don't know, the artist deleted the entry hatch for the crew. Let me show you. The wrong photo, the right original photo, and my analysis. Uh, wrong photo, the right photo, the original photo was flipped horizontally. Then he made the montage and put the earth here. But for a reason I don't know, the artist deleted the entry hatch for the crew in the other Soyuz. He pasted it above here. Uh, the entry hatch is located on the spherical compartment called habitable compartment or Bitovoy Otsek in Russian. Here is the entry hatch. The crew entry hatch clearly visible here. And here the crew entry hatch is missing. It was blurred. This type of photograph here. This type of photograph would be impossible as there was never an opportunity for a third spacecraft to approach the Salyut 6 station while two other Soyuz spacecraft were docked at the same time. For any student of the Soviet space program, this type of photographic montage is easy to identify. Well, Thank you for your attention and keep following this channel and pay attention the next time you look at photograph because sometimes everything is not what it seems. Thank you.